people unbox stuff and they have plastic, it's oh, such good ASMR. <laughs> hey, humans, welcome back to my channel. It's Winnie BLV, Mouth of the South. No intro, no outro. It's just this. Oh, thank you for this collab today. I know I've been doing a lot of collabs, but this is a collab, a mother effing collab again with my friend Dee Dee Bean. And if you're not subscribed to her, go ahead and do so now. After you watch my video, of course, if you came over from Dee Dee's channel, thank you so much. We have a collab doing some Dooney and Bird. Dooney and Bird. <laughs> At the end, I did rebuy my very first, the exact one that I had back in the early 90s. You could not tell me a thing, which was my gateway drug into all of these other bags and every bag you've seen me buy. This kind of started it all, but I'm going to show you that at the very end of the video. But I did buy this bag because Dee Dee bought this bag and it was so freaking cute. It like mesmerized me, okay? I will tell you, someone asked me in my live the other day, Day with candy what we thought about Dooney and Burke leather and you know is it as good as luxury and I think it is I've always said you know Dooney and Burke do not sleep on Dooney and Burke they are very good customer service wise uh, if something breaks falls off or tears up they're very good to fix it for you you just have to call customer service or drop them an email very good customer service and I just like that you can you know there's so many places that you can buy buy Dooney and Burke. You can't go in everywhere and find a Louis Vuitton bag or any of these other bags behind me. You can't just even coach. You, you know, you can't readily go to every single store and find all the coach bag. You know, not all of us have access to that, but I can go to my department stores and still find really great Dooney and Burke bags. I can go online. They're, they have an eBay store girl. I can't sing the praises of Dooney and Burke enough. I just always have loved them. They were my very first love. Then I went to coach coach and then all hell broke loose. All right, so without like keeping on, keeping on, I want to show you the bag that she influenced me to buy. Oh, I love this sound. I love when people unbox stuff and they have plastic. It's, oh, it's such good ASMR. <laughs> all right, here it is. Oh my old school duck yes come through duck come through seriously this is a vibe oh my god it's so cute can y'all tell i've been watching caleb and zane just a teeny bit too much oh my gosh i love it Dee, Dee this bag though i wonder now is this the exact same bag you got i think it is i'm pretty sure i don't know i was probably three sheets to the wind <laughs> you know totally tober on my sleep meds one night when I bought this. I'm sure I already know I bought this on my sleep meds because when it came in, I was like, wait, I did what? Right okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I remember. <laughs> yeah, I vaguely remember, but I just went out in search of what she had. And like I said, I will link her. You can see her unboxing. And then she has a very special bag kind of similar to this. Might even be better than this. I think it's a different color. So we'll have to go over and check her out. I really don't know. She just told me she bought one and let's collab. And I was like, okay, girl, I'm down. Let's go. Get your stuff and come on, you know? <laughs> but I love this. Oh, they got the best leather. The stitching is so cute. I love yellow stitching like Louis Vuitton. Tan does yellow stitching. I just love it. I love a contrast stitching moment anyway. <gasps> Look how cute. This is like a pink canvas or whatever. Yeah, it's a heavy canvas inside. Oh, I love that. Oh my gosh. What? Okay. Guess what they gave me, guys? Friggin' Dooney and Burke dust bag. Okay, so they're not that great. They're kind of that papery thing like you get from the real real. But still, a dust bag nonetheless. Thank you, Dooney and Burke. I think I paid close to 200 bucks for this. I got it on sale, of course. I don't know what regular price, but I'm down. I'm totally down. Oh, yeah. 
It's got the tiniest, teeniest little pocket right here, girl. What are you getting in that pocket? From nothing, hopes, dreams, aspirations. That's about it. So fill this thing out. Like, yes, get your bag registered. That way, if you do ever have a problem, which you probably won't, but down the road, because you keep Dooney and Burke. I'm looking at some Dooney and Burke that I've had 20 something years right now, since the 90s. Unfortunately, that bag that I'm going to show you at the end of the video, the very first bag that started it all off, I broke the, you know, I carried it until the wheels basically broke off of it, the handles and everything. So I had to, I had to pitch it. But girl, I mean, it's not like now. Now you can part out things. You can go on, you know, Dooney and Burke groups and, hey, I've got this, I've got that. And people will really be like, hey, yeah, I'm, I'm doing a project. Let me get it. Yeah, there was none of that back then. We were like, ring, ring, rotary phone, hello? Or maybe a push button, but no. <laughs> Nothing beyond that. Oh my gosh, the pink in here just makes it so freaking cute. I love this. To me, it's kind of preppy. I think I love preppy. My love for preppiness goes way back to when preppy was the thing in the 80s. Like, I've always so this to me just screams, hello, hey, bring the yawn around, hello, love it. You know what I mean? It looks regal, or not regal, but it looks like rich and like preppy and fun. And I don't know, I just am into it. This, oh, this is kind of squishy and leather. Oh yeah, the duck. And guess what they sent me? This went on, cue the duck. <laughs> oh my gosh, Dee Dee Bean, thank you so much for unboxing this when you did because I was paying attention and I was like, yes, today, yep, happening. Oh my gosh, guys, it, I mean, it does come down to my actual hip. What? I love it when things go down to my hip. <laughs> Just saying. But yeah, we're talking about crossbodies and that's where you want a crossbody. I do anyway. Or do we do a, do we do a little booby mama? Nope, nope, she's too big for that, yeah. <laughs> when have you heard that last? Okay, I love, I just absolutely. Oh my God, the leather. <sighs> I am crazy about this. So still the very heavy duty medallion. I will say when I was young and I carried the Dooney bags, they did when you put your stuff in them tend to get a little heavy, but you know, that all weather leather, guys, it's no joke. It is all weather, but it's like a tank. It really is, <laughs> except the one I had because I literally dragged it around everywhere. I loved that bag so much, but this one is even better. The pink on the inside. They thought of everything. Who gave you permission? <gasps> I love, I love it, I love it, I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. Thank you, Judy and Bert. This little metal. Mm -hmm. It's already got its own bag charm. I need nothing but to shove my stuff in here and go. That's what we all want is to shove their stuff into something and go. Oh yes, that's what she said. All right, guys. Thank you, Dee Dee Bean, for collabing with me. Not a whole lot to go with this today. I am gonna take some time after I do my see you later's and come back and show you this vintage bag that I bought for very cheap. But it's kind of a project bag too. And I just, I hate that my original bag that I had back then, I don't have any more because, you know, it tore up. And I did probably send the thing in. I just, I don't know why I didn't. Like I sent the little yellow thing that you get, but I don't know why I didn't think to like, hey, Judy and Burke. I don't know. I guess, I, I guess you would have called them. <laughs> There was no, there was no any of this unless it was a, a snail mail letter that you put in the post, but yeah. Around here we say, hey, just go ahead and take that down in the mailbox. Go ahead and mail it for me. You know, that whole thing. <laughs> anyway, go over in a little bit and check out Dee Dee Bean and what she bought. I have a feeling we got sort of the same kind of thing vibe. Ooh, I'm excited to see it. Check her out. Okay, okay, guys. I love. And you know they had different colors in this too. I'll link it. I'll link this. But they had different colors. So I had a hard time. Like, should I go back into a red? Should I do a blue? Should I, should I do a green moment? But then I was like, okay, I do love this. It goes with everything. Let's do it. 
what? Thanks again, Dee Dee. I've said it a hundred times. I hope you guys have a great rest of your week. I'll be back here with a live next Tuesday. Girl, a video of some sort. We'll just get into something. You know what I mean? If you can do me a favor, hit the subscribe, hit the like, comment down below. Don't forget to ring my bell so you can see when I post new videos. It's basically like Wednesdays and Saturdays and the live on Tuesday. And then if I'm really hard up, I'll post a video on Monday because I love doing this. <laughs> <laughs> All right, do me one more favor. If y'all see my husband, girl, woo -hoo -hoo -hoo, don't tell him nothing. Bye. Okay, here we go, girl. This bag, I have not cleaned it up. I got it for $28 from eBay. I'm a very motivated seller. I love to say that. But yes, this is the bag that I had, the satchel-like all-weather leather bag. Hard to say fast. But this is exactly what it was. All the feet, the six feet on the bottom. Girl, here's the little thank you note from the girl that uh, I got the bag from. She's stuffed a little bit. All leather inside. Oh my God, what? But I am going to clean it up, shine it up, and bring it back to some luster. It's going to be fine. She's going to look great. And I will carry it. So, yes. Am I afraid of Dooney and Burke? No, I love it. I absolutely love it. I just have too many damn bags. <laughs> so, but yeah. Jackie probably loves this. You know, Jackie was telling me, she was like, girl, I have one of those all-weather leather bags. But you know what it was? It was a Liz Claiborne bag that we thought. Yeah. And it looked just like this, too. So, anyway. But, yeah. The Dooney and Burke moment. She's back. Oh, hello. Where have you been? Ugh. I need to pretend like this really is my original bag, girl, but it's not. It's just as good, though. $28. I think I gave a heck of a lot more for it back in the day. Yes. Don't sleep on Dooney. Don't do it. Oh, while well, I'm thinking of it, bag of the day. Still this, hard to style, yes, but fun to wear, abso friggin lootly. Dooney and Burke! Booty and Dirk! My booty and Dirk! <laughs> I never dreamed I would own a booty and Dirk. <laughs> A crossover and it's exactly my size. I know. Girl. I love it. I love it. I love it too. It's a booty and dirt. A booty and dirt. <laughs> I love my booty and dirt. I feel She's rich. rich. <laughs> <laughs> I feel rich. All right, swing on for grins and giggles. Give us one of the old duck noises. Biatch.